Hey there, we're at Nine Isle of Pines in Sea Pines, and this is just a look down the street. So you go down here to uh, Club Course Drive, and then you take, take a right and um, follow the bike path if you're on your bikes over to the uh, Sea Pines Forest Preserve and take a ride down through there to get to the beach. This, it's just such a cute little area over here. These are on patio lots. Um, so the homes are a little close together. Here's the, a look at the house from the outside. I'm parked in the, the little um, off-street parking here, but the garage entrance is around, around the side over here, which I can show you. And this will give you some good perspective too on how much space there is on this side between the homes. So this is, this is nice. Um, looks like a new driveway. Roof is in good shape. You can see the little side porch over here and the little walkway that goes around to the back of the lot. Nothing across the street. And I'm here at in the evening. So you can see the sun is setting over in this direction. So in the evening you'll have, um, it'll be cooler in the back of the house. You have your Trash in HVAC, I think, over here. Someone left the door open. Um, yeah, they have the HVAC elevated, and that is probably where they keep their trash as well. And they come right in and take, take your trash from there. Cute little front porch, nice front door. And I left the lights off for the most part in here. We may turn a few on, but I wanted you to see how nice and bright it is. When you come in the front door, you have a closet, coat closet straight ahead. The bulk of the home this way. I'm just gonna peek out here, show you the garage. Two car garage with a little bit of storage on the back side and a little wet sink here and a little bit of storage over here. Nice tall ceilings in here and just a few steps in to the home. Wide hallway coming through here, your kitchen with breakfast table or everyday table is here. Nice, nice use of this space with the extra cabinets. And they are soft clothes access out here to the side porch. Really lovely. Little little desk here. It's not a big kitchen, but they've really made use of the space. Love the tall skylight that just lets the sun shine in here. Over here in the pantry, you have some pull out shelves. If you wanted to do gas, I think that you could, I'm not 100% certain, but I think that you could, since we're elevated, you probably would be able to get a gas line run in, in here, um, if that were important to you. Like the use of the window over the kitchen sink. And then we come into the main part of the home, where you have good space for dining, and then the living room, very cute and comfortable. Smooth ceilings, nice uh, overhead lighting. Love this little sitting area here. Just really very special. Great windows, beautiful view out the back. I'll go out here. Out to your side table, your side porch, <laughs> where you have a table and a place for your grill. If you have a pet, you can close off the gate over there, keep them contained. You do have water back here, and it's full right now because we had a good bit of rain this afternoon. Uh, but what I do like is everything is nice and dry all around the lot. Um, 
but this is title, I do believe. And here's the back of, of the home with an awning, which is just lovely. No room for it for a pool or anything like that, obviously. That is actually your property stakes through here. So this, where their stepping stones are along here, are actually over the property line, but I'm, I'm quite certain that nobody nobody cares. There, I'm sure there's either a variance or no, nobody's going to make you remove those. You can see next door they have have some uh, fencing, a little bit of fencing back there. But this is just fantastic back through here. Again, love the, love the awning, the gutters, uh, downspouts. So, and then this golf view is just beautiful. The doors, while they're not brand new, the sliding glass doors, they appear to be in reasonably good shape where you wouldn't have to worry about having these replaced any anytime soon. And the trim work is, is quite lovely. Oh, I must have picked something up out there. And then you have access out to the back, both through this door as well as over here. This is a little, you might have somebody, I don't know if that translates, but it looks like when they did this, when they smoothed these ceilings out, you may have someone come in and, and just sand that down a little bit better, but I don't think there's anything wrong with it. Just It just needs to be sanded down a bit. So, whoops, I'm trying to take these shoes off so I don't get anything on the floors. The floors are a luxury vinyl plank. They're really very nice. Back here, coming back towards the bedrooms, you have a pull down here. First uh, bedroom with the, I believe that's a queen bed, love the rug. And then the bunk beds in, in this room, again, with the overhead lights, uh, the recessed lights, very nice. This bath has a, this is a common bath, has a new vanity. The floors are original and probably somewhere along the line, someone, maybe not this owner, uh, put this, this tile around and a raised commode. There is a pocket door coming in here. We'll go out here and come back in around the side. This side, so you access it from the hall as well. We have some more, this could be, yeah, washer and dryer is here. Looks like the dryer maybe has has seen better days, but it doesn't look like it's horrible. Just a little bit of rust on top, and then we come back into this same bathroom that we were just in. So this bathroom is going to service these two bedrooms. Love this bedroom with the vaulted ceilings, some nice extra space. Access again out onto the, out onto the um, deck. Really lovely. King size bed in here. And then around the corner is the owner's suite. With a tray seat, double tray ceiling. This is very spacious. New vanity and mirrors in here. Again, smooth ceilings. You could replace the floors at some point. And then they have put in a new shower, which is lovely. Open this up for you so you can see the floor. Very nice. Commode is in here as well. They probably couldn't figure quite out how to line things up to do a private commode. And then you have, wow, a nice, Nice size walk-in closet with some built-ins. So this is it. This is Nine Pine. Ooh. 
uh, Nine Isle of Pines. And uh, really, it's a, it, it's a really great home. See what you think, and I will talk to you soon.